Hi folks, welcome back to my channel where I'm posting an art video every day for the 2018 Inktober Drawing Challenge. Today is day 18 and the word prompt is bottle and with my animal themed Inktober it wasn't too difficult to decide what to paint so I chose what I thought would be a fairly simple ink painting of a bottlenose dolphin. So for the painting today I picked out just three of my Dr. PH Martin's coloured Bombay India inks and they were the blue, violet and black and before painting mixed a good amount of the blue and violet ink together to get a really nice rich raw blue for the background. So if you like this video please give it a thumbs up, comment and consider subscribing to my channel and hit the bell icon as well if you don't want to miss out on future videos. With today's painting I decided to use the wet on wet technique to paint in the background and did this first leaving the dolphin free of any water to paint in once the background had dried. So I was pleased with the initial colour I'd mixed and how it laid down initially but I did have a few problems after trying to lift areas of ink out for the lighter areas and reflections in the water. I found that I was getting a lot of streakiness and because I'd gone in with quite a strong colour straight away was worried that I wouldn't be able to even things out. So I ended up waiting for the first layer to dry before going in with another layer and even adding some white ink to try and pull those areas of light back out. Or add them back in. And this kind of had mixed results because the white ink is still fairly transparent and not really opaque enough to have made that much of a difference. Although you can see a little bit of change up in the top right hand corner. So by this point I was starting to think it wasn't going to work out but I persevered and it did dry a bit less streaky so I carried on and applied a darker blue for the dolphin's reflections. And then once this was dry it was time for the painting of the dolphin himself and even this didn't really go very smoothly. I couldn't seem to get the right colour, I was laying down really blotchy layers of ink as well and I kept needing to add multiple layers especially on the dolphin's fins to get the values I needed. And I think normally I'd have gone in a lot darker, like when I did the whales a couple of days ago it did seem to work a lot easier. This time I kind of built up but started off too light I think and just didn't really get into the swing of it. So at this point I did decide to go and have a break, have a cup of tea and think about what to do. I didn't really have time to redo the whole painting and the light was already fading as it's been a bit of a grey day today so I went back with renewed determination to try and salvage what I could and I came to the conclusion that sometimes paintings go through an ugly phase. But the answer is not to admit defeat and bin the painting but to realise that even the best paintings might go through this phase but you do need to see it through to the end. And I'm glad I finished it in the end, it would have been easy enough to start again but then I would have felt rubbish and learnt much less than actually working through the ugly phase to finish it on a much more positive note. It's not the best painting but it's finished and maybe today was just an off day. I do find that I have good painting days and not so good painting days as well so I'm looking forward to having a better day tomorrow. So let me know in the comments box if you find this as well with your paintings. Do you sometimes find that things come really easily to you and other days something similar will just be a lot of effort and just not go your way? But I suppose the thing with Inktober is you haven't really got time to dwell on what went wrong too much and you really haven't got time to kind of redo all the paintings that don't turn out as you want them to. So in a way it kind of forces you to push forward 
not have any regrets and look back and just take from it things that you have learned and that you can make changes in the future and in subsequent paintings. And I think even at this point it was kind of still looking really blotchy and I still wasn't sure but then right at the end it kind of pulled together and I think by adding some sort of highlights with my white gel pen it did kind of salvage it a bit so adding in some reflections into the water some little details with some spray and finally getting to the point where I think the dolphins um, colour was dark enough as well the contrast with the white did kind of pull it all together So then at this point I did start to feel a little bit more positive about it and I could see that the end was in sight and that I'm glad I carried on and pushed through that sort of ugly phase to reach a finished painting at the end of it. So let me know what you think of this video, let me know if you share any of the feelings that I've mentioned today or any of the struggles that you might have had during your paintings as well and don't forget if you like this video to give it a thumbs up comment and subscribe and i'll see you all again tomorrow